Yes, Valentine's Day, the day of love is here. And we need to know which one are we going to wear for tonight. Let's check it out. Latin Spice. Ay, ay, ay. Latin Spice. Here to make you smell nice. Latin Spice. Here to make you smell nice. Latin Spice. Here to make you smell right Latin Spice Ooh, la, la. Welcome to Latin Spice, my name is Manny and I'm here to help you out with your fragrance journey So if you like this content, if you like fragrances, make sure you like comment and subscribe to this channel so that way we can push these videos to the youtube algorithm and get it all out there so that way everyone can find out who latin spice really is all right today we're going to be talking about that fragrance that you're going to wear for valentine's day that fragrance that's going to make sure it gets the job done and i love to consider this one that we're going to talk about today the panty dropper yes the panty dropper now um the panty dropper for me and my relationship, okay? Whatever you guys do in your own time, that's between you and God, all right? But anyways, today we are going to review Baccarat Rouge 540. This amazing, sexy beast of a fragrance that everyone absolutely loves or absolutely hates. Uh, believe it or not, there's a lot of people that cannot stand and the smell of this perfume, this cologne. Uh, but what can I tell you? This is one of my top, top fragrances. And I don't use too much of it because I want to conserve it. So, you know, I try to use less sprays, the less sprays possible. Uh, so this one, I'm telling you, this one is the one to wear for Valentine's Day. And it will get the job done. Believe me. What is in this fragrance? What is in this perfume? Let's actually talk about that. So with this one, you're going to get on the top, saffron and jasmine, so you're gonna have those floral notes in there. The mid, you're going to have amberwood and ambergris, and the base is fir resin and cedarwood. So really interesting notes here. You got the floral, you got the woody going on here. You got the amber in there, so this is pretty interesting. But before we get started and spray it, so I just want to make sure that you guys see the bottle one more time. All right, that's what it looks like. Has a really nice top. You're going to have the MK there. So based on Francis Curzon. Um, right here, you're going to have like, I don't know, this artwork right there. There's the bottom. It's really a really classy, beautiful bottle. The top has some weight to it as well. It actually makes this really light once you take off the top. Um, so really nice and very intoxicating, guys. This is intoxicating. This is going to get the job done, believe me. I just noticed there that there's also an MK there. Let's see, can we get that in there? Can we get that visual? Uh, I don't think it's working out there for us there, but it's there. Okay, it's there. So let me spray this on. Really great atomizer. I love it. Absolutely love it. Men and women can wear this one. It's a unisex fragrance, but I love it on me. I love how it smells on me. My wife loves how it smells on me. My family loves how it smells on me. My friends love how it smells on me. Everyone that has smelled this on me compliments me on this. This gets me so many compliments. It is a compliment beast. And, you know, sometimes with the compliments, you might have to pay a little more for. This one is a 2.4 ounce. 2.4 ounce, guys. You have to pay $325 retail for this. Is that how much I paid for it? Almost. I got a discount uh, from Neiman Marcus uh, for my good boy, uh, Anthony, who doesn't work there anymore in the Neiman Marcus in Shore Hills Mall, New Jersey. But 
I'm telling you guys, this is a beast. A beast of a fragrance. It smells like like a sweet burnt caramel with woods. And you get the floral notes in there. It's something that you just have to sniff and you just have to try and you have to get a sample of it. And once you do, you're going to want it. You're just going to want it. Now, the only downfall to this fragrance is that it has had so much success that there has been a lot of clones. Plenty of clones on this one. I know a uh, Cloud by Ariana Grande. Um, and I think our moth. If I'm not mistaken, I think our moth also came out with one recently. But for me, I would always need the, the original. With this one, I could not get the clone for this one. I would have to keep the original. It's just that good. It's just to know that I have this in my collection is very important for me. MFK, wonderful, wonderful fragrance. So let's go to the ratings. Let's go to the performance. When it comes to the projection, this is going to project like crazy, guys. You only need like two sprays with this one. So for that, easily, you got a 10 out of 10. Easily 10 out of 10. No doubt about it. Eau de Parfum concentration here. It works wonderfully. When it comes to the sillage, people are going to smell you depending on how much you spray. If you spray one or two, people are going to smell you automatically. If you spray three or four, you're going to basically have uh, those beautiful ladies faint. All right, so you gotta be careful. Be easy with the sprays on this one. So that's a 10 out of 10, obviously, for the sillage. People are definitely gonna smell you with this one. And then we have to go to the longevity on this. The longevity is a good 10, 11, 12, 13 hours. 10 out of 10. It's that amazing of a beast. Um, this is one where you're spending over $300 and it's $300 well spent. I'm gonna just put it like that. It's $300 well spent. It does not disappoint, it performs. It smells amazing, it's intoxicating. The panty dropper for sure, you have to wear this on Valentine's Day. And believe me, no matter how much she says, oh, we're not gonna do nothing, put this on and you will see, you will see. You will see, trust me, trust me. Now. We're not going to go and find out what the missus has to say about this one because I don't want her to know that I'm going to use this tonight. So uh, I'm not going to call her over here for this one. But um, believe me, she absolutely loves it. She absolutely loves it. And every time I wear this, yes, your boy gets lucky. Your boy gets lucky or your boy gets blessed. All right. So let me know right now in the comments section below, what will you be wearing for Valentine's Day, guys? Do you even have a date? If you do, please comment below what you will be wearing for Valentine's Day. Which one are you going to kill her with, all right? So put it down there and let me know what you guys think. Is this the correct one to wear for this occasion? Is there something better than Baccarat Rouge 540 for Valentine's Day? You guys let me know in the comments below, all right? So, remember, as always, I'm Latin Spice, and I'll make sure you smell nice. Take care, guys.